Hi, this is Ironclad Ingredients and today I have a new video, another video about supplements. Actually one supplement. This supplement is l citrulline malate. I talked about it in my last video. The feedback I got from friends who watched that video, they wanted to uh, hear more details and, and learn more about this component. So l citrulline malate <clears throat> consists of two items. One is l citrulline and the other one is malad. L-citrulline is non-essential amino acid. That means your body makes it. Um, however, it doesn't make it in the quantities uh, that will give the following properties or increase the following properties. Supplementing L-citrulline, and sometimes you can take it by itself in a supplement instead of uh, L-citrulline malad. Supplementing that will um, increase the size of your uh, body, uh, your uh, blood vessels. It will um, reduce the soreness in your muscles um, and, and it will promote better workout. Reason that this is doing it because L-citrulline gets converted in your kidneys to L-arginine, which is another amino acid, L-arginine. It gets uh, converted to uh, NO, which is nitrogen oxide. And that uh, molecule, it does increases your blood vessels size. That means your uh, blood pump or the, you know, the pumping blood into your uh, cells increases. And also promotes ATP or empowers ATP. What's ATP? It's adenosine triphosphate, which is the, the energy source in your cells and your body, uh, body cells. Um, adenosine triphosphate or ATP is found in almost all living cells and um, it's, it's, it's like the molecule currency of the cell. So when the cell has a lot of stack of ATP, this is a rich cell. This is the biological term that they use for it. The other component is malate. <clears throat> what malate is, Basically, it's the ester or the salt of the malic acid. And uh, malic acid also promotes um, higher cell and um, higher energy in the cells. And also works as a good vessel or a good uh, transportation method for the l citrulline itself to go into your uh, muscle cells. So l citrulline mallet can be found, uh, sorry, l citrulline can be found in um, melons, cucumbers. Mallet also can, can be found naturally in apples or berries or grapes or apricots. These are uh, the fruits that they are rich with mallet. Uh, another thing I wanted to talk about is um, the, who, who uses that? So basically, um, it's, uh, the studies show that it's better when used by experienced lifters or experienced athletes. So if you're new, new to lifting or new to the sports, it's not recommended for you to use. And I personally don't recommend anything for new lifters except whey protein because uh, whey protein is just a substitute of the amount of protein that your body needs to uh, build and repair muscle cells. So um, the studies that I uh, looked at or the videos on the internet, uh, they were a lot. And uh, I chose a couple of videos. One is by Dr. Chrissy Kandel and another one by Dr. Ford um, Bermer. Also, Jim Stepani of Jim Supplements, very famous supplement company, did a couple videos about l citrulline and l citrulline malate. And I think Jim is uh, a PhD, but I'm not sure. So he's a, he's a researcher. However, you have to keep in mind, most of these researchers, they do the work for the supplement companies. So you have to gather the information and kind of make a judgment if this is uh, biased or not biased opinion and uh, also if you want to give it a shot use it and monitor it closely did it work for you or not and it's good to share the experience like I am sharing right now with others um,
The non-exercise benefit for L-citrulline, um, it also helps with uh, hypertension. So, uh, because it pumps a lot of blood into your uh, system and widens the blood vessels, so it reduces the blood pressure, it helps in reducing the blood pressure. Also, it was found it helps with erectile dysfunctions. Uh, studies show that uh, patients who suffer from that using l it, it impacted their abilities or uh, it actually um, it was um, it helped fixing the erectile dysfunctions. Effective dosages. So they say to uh, really feel the benefit of it, five to six grams, and it goes anywhere between 12 to 16 weeks to really see the benefit of it, to see the difference. And do not take more than 80 grams per serving because you could uh, face one of the very little uh, side effects that was found in the studies, which is the uh, gastro gastrointestinal uh, upset, bloating, and uh, you'll experience you know, some muscle pain and cramps. That's why uh, you have to keep it under that. And that's per serving. So if you wanna, you wanna go up, you can do 12 grams per day, but make sure you don't exceed 80 grams per serving. And that's what the studies uh, talk about. How did I use it? I started with two grams a serving twice a day. So that's four. And then I increased it to six, and then I increased it to nine. And then I increased it to 12. I mixed it with creatine. It was a good combination because creatine, it actually helps ATP, increases ATP. So in, uh, in combination with creatine, BCAA, and l citrulline malate. That was my pre-workout. I don't use the stimulant workouts. That's why I put my pre, uh, sorry, stimulant pre-workout. That's why I put my uh, pre-workout component together. Another serving, I did it before bed because I stopped eating about two, three hours before bed. So I did another serving before bed, same components. Reason is because um, also it's been proven in the studies that to avoid having the uh, upset, the stomach upset, um, have it on empty stomach. So mix it with a juice or anything, but have it on empty stomach. It's, it reduces the risk of having the side effect. So uh, as I mentioned uh, uh, before in my other video, uh, the type of I the type of the l citrulline mallet that I used was my protein, which is this here. This is my protein. It's a supplement company and uh, this serving, I don't know if you can see it, but it's three grams per serving. And um, um, this one, I got it from the internet. Uh, they have, they always, this company, they always have good deals on amino acids and proteins and stuff like that. You should check them out. They have good sales all the time. I bought other components from them. I'll talk about them later, uh, other supplements I mean. And that's it. Please give me the likes, uh, share this video, and also put some comments in there to see how, uh, you know, like to get the feedback from uh, different people. Thank you very much.